This week's topic was emotional development and use of technology. For my first article, I chose to examine a piece by Heather Clellan Woods entitled Hashtag Sleepy Teens, and it talks about how social media use in adolescence is becoming associated with poor sleep quality, anxiety, depression, and low self-esteem. The article provides a mixed method study, and it looks at the links between the use of social media and then the quality of sleep and how those two things together are impacting self-esteem, anxiety, depression, and overall mental health. It was discovered that 90% of adolescents are using social media and there does seem to be a link between mental health and well-being and use of social media. More than 37% of teenagers are losing sleep because of social media use and an overall fear of missing out. So they are going to bed and checking their devices at all hours of the night. It was concluded in the study that those who use social media more frequently as well as those who are more emotionally invested in using it uh, have poor sleep quality and therefore their self-esteem and mental health rates are much lower. The article provides a very detailed methodology and this helps attribute to its credibility. Uh, there were 467 teens from Scotland studied, they're aged 11 to 17 and they did written and online surveys as well as various tests to measure some of the factors mentioned. For example, sleep quality is measured using the Pittsburgh Sleep Quality Index, anxiety and depression are measured using the HAD scale. The article was an excellent source. Um, it's very effective in that it's very well written, well researched, and while it does not provide suggestions or recommendations, it does indicate that the findings should act as a starting point for future research. Some possible moderators include whether or not gender plays a role in the conclusions of the study, whether certain ethnicity groups might be impacted more than others, as well as when these issues are starting to begin in use. Possible mediators include how social groups and peer pressure might influence a fear of missing out, and also why screen lights are impacting sleep quality. This article does relate to my interest in the negative impacts that technology may have on human development and well-being, and therefore would serve as an excellent source for the section of a potential final paper in this course.